Hey guys, it's uh, Gameplay Horizon here and uh, welcome back to Eternal Evolution. So uh, let's uh, continue our journey on this uh, exotic expedition and uh, I have done my research and test guys and wow, my god, this is really insane guys. So I've tested uh, these uh, assassins here, almost all heroes guys, but it is not good. The best heroes here are summoners, okay? So uh, this is exotic expedition, okay, this is... Uh, Let's check, guys. This is uh, current week 10. And, okay, let's uh, try this. This would be the Destroyer Quinta. So, this is the best heroes, guys. Or, these are the best heroes to use. I have a uh, save these heroes. And, okay, let's deploy this. Okay, these are the best heroes, guys. So, I've tested tanks. And uh, only Tarish can uh, block the damage of this boss. And uh, we have here Anpu. We have Miranda. We have Daniel. And also Purinezaki. So by checking here, uh, Anpu, we have here an Awakened 5 Anpu. So if you have an Awakened 5 Anpu or above, that would be great. And uh, this Anpu is using this uh, critical uh, set. Okay, this would be the crit rate uh, uh, gauntlets. And uh, if you have uh, Awakened 5 or above, uh, Daniel, my god, this would be very, very easy, guys. So this is currently my setup. And uh, by checking here first, the equipment we have here. Okay, let's check first Starish, guys. So the Starish is only using this uh, opportunistic set with uh, some uh, HP on uh, helmet. And we have your HP on boots. And this is the blast set, guys. So by checking here the stats of Starish, we have here an HP that is 6.9 million. And uh, we have here some... Uh, I need the uh, damage reduction, guys. That is 83%. So damage reduction is uh, quite important here for Starish. And uh, we have here 119,000 on Anpu, which is the attack. And the crit rate, that would be 64% plus 16%. And on this Miranda, uh, we have here an accuracy that is 167 and at HP 4.2 million. On this Apurin Isaki, we have here 3.4 million HP with an accuracy that is over 200. And on Daniel, we have here 128,000 uh, attack and we have here 72 plus a 16% a crit rate. And take note, we have here 164% a crit damage. So this is currently my setup and uh, I would suggest get this guys for summoner uh, for enlighten I mean we have your crit rate uh, middle crit rate at the back we have your crit rate for summons so that uh, it would be uh, very uh, nice for your team to have some decent crit rate and you can offset those uh, extra crit rate on your gears to your crit damage so that you can have some lots of uh, damage guys you can offset on Anpu either crit damage or attack but I prefer crit damage guys okay so anyway, uh, let's go back. And uh, I think maybe you can offset on Anpu. You can also use a full attack here like on gloves so that the Anpu will be buffed by Purinizaki. Provided you have a decent crit rate that would be uh, 60 plus or maybe 70 plus. Okay. So the technique here in order to enhance the damage, we need to uh, set up the Starish to critical gears. So this would be the critical gears. I think uh, we have here the crit rate. Okay, let's see. Check the crit rate, guys. Okay, the crit rate of... Uh, Tarish, that would be 65% already. And we have your 75% uh, damage reduction. So that is uh, very, very important because sometimes uh, due to the RNG, there is a fluctuation of damage. So anyway, let's uh, challenge this and let's see. Okay, so Tarish, take a look at that. Tarish can tank the uh, attack of the boss then. Tarish will throw that uh, Daniel at the back. Okay. And always pay attention to this uh, the, the time remaining and also the HP of the boss. That is a uh, very, very important and always uh, uh, put your uh, fingers here on the pause button because sometimes due to the RNG your team will be compromised okay so that uh, this is an automatic stop here <laughs> okay so uh, pay attention to this guys we have 57 seconds uh, 57 percent 56 we have your 49 and uh, down okay just pay attention to that guys Okay, that is 47. It should be uh, the HP of the boss is uh, lower compared to this, uh, the, the number here on this uh, seconds, on this time. So we have 38, 37. Okay, I think we can chase now. Nice. We can chase, guys. Take a look at that. We've got 29%, 26. Okay, let's see. Okay, 20. Wow. My goodness. Okay, there's Starish. And take a look at that. Anpu. Okay, we have now 12%. We have still here 19 uh, seconds. And I think we can defeat this. Okay, 2%. My goodness. Wow. Wow. My God. I love this. Okay, so uh, I think uh, we don't have casualties. Let's check, guys, if we have casualties here. I think we don't have casualties. Some of these uh, heroes are pretty bad. And I think uh, we should uh, replace them, guys. 
So like for example, Leo, we don't need Leo here. And this uh, Samael, we don't need Samael. Also, maybe we, we need here Res. And we don't need also this one, Evere. And other heroes here. Um, uh, maybe we need here Evere, guys, together with Tarish. Because we need to defeat those uh, vanguards. Okay, so uh, I think uh, Amat, we don't need Amat. And also Rikert. So those were the heroes that uh, we need to eliminate next time. And uh, we should replace that with the uh, energy heroes. Okay. So energy heroes plus uh, summoner heroes are pretty good to use. Especially on this uh, prism world. So in this case, guys, I think uh, we need to sacrifice our units here. So we have here Anpu and uh, Jashidi. This Anpu and Jashidi have some uh, lives. And there were the expedition elite heroes. And we will use here, okay, our useless heroes, guys. <laughs> and we have here also Samael. And we have here Amat. Okay, let's use that. I think that that would be fine. Okay, let's uh, challenge this, guys. Mm -hmm. Let's see. So, I will be using your auto battle. Let's uh, sacrifice those uh, heroes first. Nice. We need to lower the HP of these uh, heroes. Nice one. And there's Jashidi. My god. Jashidi is so strong. Okay, we have a 83%. Wow. That was pretty insane. Okay, we have 80%, guys. Nice. Okay, 78%. <laughs> okay, let's use again Anpu and uh, Jashidi. Okay, we have here. Where is that Anpu? Okay, we have one life for Anpu. And we have one life for Jashidi. And we can use this. Okay, these were useless heroes, guys. Two. Okay. Oh. We have also here Dominic. Okay, wow, we have your Sif. Okay. So let's not use. Okay, we have your also. <laughs> we have your Elantis. Okay, let's uh, challenge this, guys. Okay, let's see. So that now we can only lower the uh, HP of the boss. Thank God. Oops. I think we need to use here. In order to prolong the uh, life of uh, assassins, we'll use that uh, phantom cloak. Okay. Nice. Wow. God. What is that? <laughs> I should have used a manual battle, my god. Okay, so we have a last life for Anpu. Hey God, that was wrong. Holy moly. Okay, guys, uh, let's use our uh, summoner team here. Wow, I should have used manual battle, guys. My God. Okay, there it is. <laughs> let's see. <laughs> okay. And uh, we will be using here manual battle for both uh, Jashidi and Daniel. Nice. Actually, the best thing about that Sif is uh, Gobo and also those pebbles, guys. Those pebbles uh, explodes like bombs, which uh, amplifies also the damage of Anpu. Okay, there's Daniel. Nice one. My god. Okay. For those uh, players who have uh, Awakened 7 Daniel, this would be very, very easy for you guys. Okay, we have 38%. With 36%, guys. My god. I hope we can defeat this. <laughs> Okay, we have 25. My god. Okay, 12 seconds, guys. Guys, it's 12 seconds. Wow. 7 seconds. 
Three seconds, my god. <laughs> my god. We made an error on the uh on that uh, assassins guys. Uh we should have uh beat this. Okay, let's uh challenge and my goodness. Okay, let's use here our tanks now. Anyway, uh, this is only my uh, first impression, guys. Uh, we will uh, clear this uh, next time. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that was fun. My God. Okay. My goodness. So, uh, without the Purin Izake, I don't think if uh, we can beat uh, the next uh, team, that would be the Vanguards, the Moo Lion. I don't know if uh, we can beat that. Okay, let's uh, try that, guys. My goodness. We should have uh, summoners here. At this uh, moment. Okay. Let's see if uh, we can uh, beat this. Okay, that's 80%. Are we using here critical type? Yes. I think we are using here a crit type, guys. This is a crit type of pandemonium, as you can see. The, uh... What you call that? The nuclear shock are all critical. My goodness. Wow. We're dead. I think uh, we need here Putin is happy. So, anyway, uh, that's it, guys. Uh, thank you for watching, and... Uh, See you again next time. We will beat this next time, guys. Bye-bye.